Evan Holyfield versus Chris Rollins. Who do y'all think is going to win this fight? Before I get more into the video, I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more boxing and please hit that like button. It helps out the video. It helps out the channel. I'd really appreciate it. So to those who don't know, this fight between Holyfield and Rollins is scheduled for six rounds in the junior middleweight division to take place on the 22nd of January, January 22, 2022. Live over at the Borgata Hotel and Casino in New Atlantic City, New Jersey, USA. In the undercard of the Gary Russell versus Mark Magsayo fight. I'm not entirely sure if this fight between Oldfield and Colin Rollins will be part of the uh, Showtime card. I think it will. But don't quote me on that. <laughs> you never know. Maybe... The only way to watch it is to be there live in person. I'm not entirely sure if it will be part of the Showtime card. I hope it is because why not? Evan Holyfield is the son of the legendary Evander Holyfield. So start promoting him. Start showcasing him. I'm sure there's a, a lot of uh, Holyfield fans out there that would love to see how Evan Holyfield looks. Um, to those who don't know, he is, like I said, the, young, the son of... Evander Holyfield, currently undefeated at the age of 24 years old, 8-0, 6 wins coming by way of Nakar TKO, turned pro back in 2019, fought twice in 2019, and fought 1, 2, 3, 3 times in 2020, and fought 3 times in 2021, and now here he is for his first fight of the year in 2022 and his ninth professional fight against Chris Rollins, a 32-year-old fighter from Virginia, with a record of 5 wins, 3 losses, 1 draw, Four wins coming by way of Nakar TKO. So I think he has like a MMA back background as well. Uh, but yeah, as a professional, lost three fights, won five, coming off a loss against Giovanni Stella back in uh, December 2021, uh, where he wa lost by unanimous decision. Uh, he also got knocked out by Vito Milnicki Jr. Um, back in August 2020. And base of what I've seen of Chris Rollins. This fight should be an easy win for Evan Holyfield. Um, it's definitely one of those fights made for Evan Holyfield, which is, is the A-side to win and look good and to move on to bigger and better things. I think Evan Holyfield should be able to go out there and win this fight fairly and uh, easily. I'll be shocked and very surprised if Chris Rollins somehow pulls off the big win. Um, Evan Holyfield got this. I'm pretty confident he's going to win this fight, whether it's by TKO or knockout. Uh, fight scheduled for six rounds, so I would say TKO knockout round number three. Or two. Two or three. But we'll see. I could be wrong. I've been wrong many times before. Who knows? Maybe Chris Rollins will shock us and somehow pull, pull it off. You never know. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And uh, like always, have a great day. Alright, thanks.